Presenting a Growing Little Ones video. Hey everybody, we have the Bubble Guppies Checkup Center. Look at how neat this is. And here is Bubble Puppy, and it comes with, and then you have some buttons that make some fun noises. Next guppy patient, step right up. And this button is the x-ray machine. And it is so much fun. I can't wait to get this out of the box. Down here are some of the other sets that you can buy. And we have some of the pieces to these sets. So let me show you what we've got. We have the really hard to find Bubble Guppy helicopter. And this actually lands up here. There's a helicopter pad and it can land on top of the hospital so it can drop off patients. Woo! And then we also have, let's go back here and I'll show you. Here is the checkup time set and we have the desk that comes with the checkup time set and the nani. And see how he has a little band-aid on his arm? So that's the pieces we have from that set. And then we have Nurse Dima from the Get Well Wishes. So there's Nurse Dima. Hopefully someday we'll be able to get the Clambulance. And that is the Bubble Guppy Ambulance. And it looks really neat, but it's super hard to find. All right, let's get this open so we can check out all these pieces. Let's see if we can get Bubble Puppy out of here. There he is. He's free. He is free. Aw, he has a Band-Aid on his head. Poor Bubble Puppy. <coughs> he needs to go to the Checkup Wellness Center. Don't worry, Bubble Puppy. We'll get that boo-boo fixed in no time. Let's get this hospital open so we can get Bubble Guppy feeling better. Let's see. Start down here. Does that look like a good place to start? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, here's part of our slide. There's going to be a slide in this hospital. The more pieces, the slide. Yeah. See if we've released it yet. Oh, it's coming loose. Oh, got another one. Here is our hospital cart so they can push around and make sure patients are taken care of. Our scale so we can see how much they weigh. Our hospital bed so patients can sleep. I think Bubble Puppy needs to take a nap that might help his boo boo. There we go. Aww, Bubble Puppy. He looks so sleepy. That is a cute bed. Okay, let's put someone else in there. Let's see, how about Goby? There we go. He looks awful happy to be in bed. <laughs> Who else wants to go in the hospital bed? What about Nurse Dima? Can the nurses go to the hospital bed? Sure can. She's like, I'm a nurse. I'm not supposed to be in the hospital bed. <laughs> I'm supposed to be taking care of people. What about our helicopter pilot? There we go. Now he's in bed. Hey, I'm supposed to be flying the helicopter, not being in bed. Get me back to my helicopter. <laughs> What about Nani? Nani has a boo-boo. He needs to go in the bed. There you go, Nani. <laughs> You'll get feeling better soon. Nurse Dima is going to take good care of you. <laughs> Let's see if Bubble Puppy fits in the wheelchair. <gasps> Look at that. And then Nurse Dima can push him around. No, not yet. There's no slide. Uh-oh. We haven't put the slide up yet. Here, let's do that. 
Alright, we snap these two pieces together and then this should snap in right there and right here. Let's set our wheelchair right here and our scale goes down here. We've got a hospital bed and our check-in desk. So, Nurse Dima is at the desk and Next guppy patient, step right up. It's Bubble Puppy! Hi, I need to check into the hospital. Alright, bring the wheelchair down and climb on board. Here we go. So now she's got him up here. Time to get an x ray. Take your x ray. Now turn for the other side and get an x-ray of the other side. Make sure no bones are broken. Skeletons aren't just for Halloween. They're in our bodies every day. You look good. So now we're going to take him down. Time to go down the slide. And we're going to go get your weight. Ooh, that was fun. Time to get his weight. You weigh two fish pounds, Bubble Puppy. You're doing good. Now, the doctor says that you need rest. So, time to get some rest. You can go down the elevator. Woo! And climb into bed, Bubble Puppy. There you go. All sleep tight when you wake up. You'll feel better. Bubble Puppy, I brought you mashed potatoes, chicken, and dog treats. Would you like anything to eat? Yes, please. I'll take some dog treats. Alright, here's some doggy treats for you, Bubble Puppy. Ooh, 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 ooh. It's helicopter pilot Gil. He has a patient for the Bubble Guppy Hospital. Who are you dropping off, Gil? I'm dropping off Nani. He has a boo-boo on his arm that needs to be checked out. All right, Nurse Dima will take good care of Nani. Thank you, Pilot Gill. You're welcome. Time to go find another patient. Woo! Hi, Nani. We just need to check in. What's your first name? My name's Nani. You know that. I know. All right, Nani, come up the elevator and we will get an x-ray. We're going up. All right, we're at the top. Now, Nani, it's time to go and get your x-ray. Welcome to the x-ray room. This x-ray machine is like a giant camera. It takes a picture of your bones. Say cheese. X-ray machines like a camera it takes a picture of your bones. Now turn the other way, Nani. Skeletons aren't just for Halloween. They're in our bodies every day. Without your bones, you'd be like gelatin. Thank goodness for your skeleton. Hey guys. Everything looks good in there. What a nice skeleton you have. Everything looks good in there. What a nice skeleton you have. Now say ah. Uh. Now say ah. Uh. some funny beeping. Welcome to the x-ray room. This x-ray machine is like a giant camera. It takes a picture of your bones. Mm -hmm. Say cheese. Alright, 
while Nani is getting his x-rays, let's go back down to the check-in center. Here, Gobi is getting his weight taken, and Nurse Dima is here at the check-in center. Check-up time. Next guppy patient, step right up. Ready for your check-up? Come on. Ready for your check-up? Come on. Hop on the scale. We'll check your weight before you see the doctor. We'll check your weight before you see the doctor. The doctor will see you now. Just yeah. swim right upstairs. The doctor will see you now. Just swim upstairs. Lots of rest. Just what the doctor ordered. Do the check-up. Check-up time. Next copy patient, step right up. Hey everybody, we've got some more Bubble Guppy toys. And you can see we have the Snap and Dress Princess set. But we also have the Snap and Dress Ballerina. And the Snap and Dress Cowgirl. We'll also have the Snap and Dress Salon coming in the mail soon. We've already done a video of the Bubble Guppy bus with Mr. Grouper and let's see who do we have in here Molly and Gil they're in our school bus we've got the Clambulance which is the Bubble Guppy Ambulance it's coming in the mail and we're gonna do a video of it soon so that is gonna be so much fun and what else have we done I love showing off all these toys look at this this is the Bubble Guppy Checkup Center. And here is Bubble Puppy. Uh oh, he fell. He doesn't normally fall. He's usually better at it than this. Try again, Bubble Puppy. There you go. I knew you could get it. <laughs> and here is Nurse Dima. And Nani with a Band-Aid. We did a video of this cool toy. But guess what? Tomorrow, we are going to do a video of the Swimsational School. And it has a Mr. Grouper and a Gill and a Molly. Look at this. And it works with the school bus that we have. Here is a better view of it. And here you can see it working with the school bus. So we're going to have the school bus and the school play set. It has all sorts of fun phrases. It says, I got a tuba fish sandwich. <laughs> That's part instrument and part fish. That's funny. Yes, and that on the movie too. <laughs> but today, with no further ado, we are going to open up all of these sets. We can mix and match them all together and dress her up. It is going to be so much fun. So which one should we open first? Cowboy girl. The cowboy girl. All right. We'll do that. I think that's okay. Yeah, I guess that's fun. That's fun? That's super fun. Ha. Let's see. Let's get it open here. Oh, but doesn't want to come. You must come. Um. There's twist ties. There's twist ties. Back here. Yeah, I believe you. Silly. Silly. You're silly. You're silly. Oh, you are. Here we go. Ha ha, we got it loose. Oh no, Molly is stuck in the plastic. Who will come and save her? It's Helicopter Pilot Gill. I'll help rescue you. Time to get her out now. Thank you, Gil. Do you need to go to the checkup center and get checked out? I think I'm good. Thank you. You're welcome. Anytime. <laughs> All right, let's get our pieces out. We've got a little cowgirl hat here. A lasso. Here is a guitar. 
change. Here is her regular hair. This is what she normally looks like on the show. And she's got a little dress over here. Here is the dress, a little cowgirl dress. Very, very neat. All right, let's see how this works. Oh, you've already got her hair on. Look at that. So that just sits on there. Is that how that works? Yeah. So there is her cowgirl hat with her little ponytails. And let's put on her cowgirl dress. This part is cloth right here. So it just slides right in there. There we go. And there is her dress. Her hands move like this. Let's give her her lasso now. So this little part curls around her wrist like this. Now she has a lasso. Yeehaw, cowgirl. I'm going to rope me in some cattle. And then her guitar. And then you can sit the guitar like this. So she can have it leaning up against her. I don't think it, actually, she doesn't hold it. It's just meant to be a stand. There we go, like that. So there she is as a cowgirl. Now you can trade out her hair. Here. And give her regular Molly hair. And she still has her cowgirl rope. Or you can take that off. Let's see. There we go. It's taken off. And there she is as regular Molly. Regular Molly wants to play the guitar. There we go. This is so cool. Now let's get out another set and do a little mix and match with them. Here is the Snap and Dress Ballerina set. It's got a little boom box and two different sets of hair and another dress. So I'm going to get this open. There we go. Will this one be hard to get out? Oh, no, that one came out easy. Yay! Oh, no. Molly's stuck in the plastic again. Who's going to rescue her? <gasps> Superhero Marshall and Chase. They'll get you out. Just yelp for help. Yelp, I'm yelping. Get me out of here. That was easy. Thanks, Marshall and Chase. Anytime. All right, let's get these pieces out. It is a boom box. Very neat. Here are two sets of hair. This one has a crown. That's really pretty. And this one has a really cool ponytail with a headband. Alright. Now we have a ballet bar and a dress. Look at that ballet dress. That is so beautiful. I've never taken ballet, but ballet is really, really beautiful to watch. So let's dress up Miss Molly again. Let's put on this dress. There we go. So here is our cowgirl dress. And here is our ballerina dress. Now let's put on her ballerina hair. And here is the first hairdo. Look at that! Oh, that is so pretty looking! I love it. Let's lean it forward a little bit so it covers up her purple hair. And these hands are a little different. One's up and one's down. And here is her ballerina pole. She uses it to balance and practice her ballerina moves. Then she has her little boom box to play music. And let's see, these aren't hers. Let's trade out her hair. There we 
go. Ooh, look how pretty that is. You know what this ballerina needs? It needs a lasso rope. <laughs> Have you ever seen a ballerina lasso a pig or a cow? <laughs> That's not right. I can't get my dress dirty, but I can lasso me a pup. Ha! She lassoed her a chase. Now I can walk my dog wherever I want. I'm nobody's pup. Woof woof. He escaped. That's <laughs> not nice. Alright, no more lasso for the ballerina. We'll give that back to the cowgirl. Uh-oh. <laughs> her dress fell off. There we go. Put your dress back on. And let's see. Ballerina dress with a cowgirl hairdo. <laughs> That's cool. That actually looks pretty neat. She's doing the cowgirl ballerina dance. <laughs> yippee ki -yay, Yippee ki -yay. We're doing the ballerina cowgirl dance. <laughs> Woohoo! Put your ballerina hair back on. There you go. Now you're styling. Take your boom box and that, your extra hair. Uh, let's see, here is Miss Cowgirl. Now we need to get the princess Molly out. Uh huh. Alright, let's do that. Scooch everybody over. Got some more tape to undo. Oh, does Princess Molly have a necklace? Uh huh. And a wand. A wand? Uh huh. Ooh. Uh oh, we've got another Molly stuck in the plastic. Who's gonna help her out? It's Mr. Grouper and Apollo. He's flying to the rescue. I'll save you, Molly. <laughs> All right, let's see if they can get her out. She's free. Thank you, Mr. Grouper and Apollo Pup. You're welcome. Glad we could help. All right, let's get her pieces out. Here is her princess wand. And... It's a fish purse. That is so cool. I love that. What else do we have in here? Her princess hair. It's got a star in it. Look at all those pretty curls. And... Oh, her crown. Looks a little bit like her ballerina crown. But it's a little bigger. And her princess dress. She's ready to go to the ball. All right, here we go. Getting her all dressed up. There's her princess dress on and some princess hair. That. And next, a wand. Next, give her the wand. You like the wand pretty well? Uh-huh. Now, time for her purse. Go this way. There we go. Yay! Now she has her wand and her purse. Stalin with a fish purse and a star wand. Let's trade her hair out. Thank you. Ah, oh, look at that hairdo. Let's compare crowns. Here is the ballerina crown with purple hair and the princess crown with teal hair. Kind of a bluish green. Looking good, Miss Molly. Now let's give her back her cowgirl hair. Whoops, took her out of her dress again. <laughs> you know what? I think she's backwards. Let's turn around. There we go. Now she's front facing. Oh, oh, she doesn't want to let go. Let go of that hair. That. <laughs> oh, oh, there we go. Now we've got it. <laughs> All right, hand me the cowgirl hair. 
So she is going to play the guitar while ballerina Molly plays her radio boombox. And princess Molly, she is going shopping. She's got her purse and her wand and she's ready to do some shopping magic. This is pretty cool. Alright, let's trade out. Let's see. Give the ballerina the guitar. There we go. And cowgirl, she wants the purse. The cowgirl's going shopping. Look at that. Now the cowgirl has the purse. And the wand. There we go. So now what she gonna have? What does the princess get? Mm -hmm. Let's see. The princess get this really cool. Whoops. <laughs> the princess gets this really cool boom box and ballerina bouncing. There we go. She's going to practice being a ballerina. All right, we've got the cowgirl here, and she's got her lasso, but she's got some special friends that are coming to visit with her. Look at this. It's Cowboy Chase and Cowboy Marshall. They've come to visit with Cowgirl Molly. Here is Zuma and Rubble, Rubble on the double. Let's see, who else do we have? It's Cowgirl Sky. She's like, I always want to visit with another cowgirl. You look really, really cool, Molly, with your cowgirl lasso. Thanks! Let's see, who are we missing? I think we're missing one. Here we go. Cowboy Rocky. Let's show Molly what all these pups do. We got Rubble. He has a shovel. He can help you dig, Miss Molly. And Chase, he has... A megaphone and a flashlight so he can help you find your way in the dark here is Marshall and he has water cannons so he can put out any fires that may happen on your farm there you go Zuma has a water pack so he can swim under the water and if you lose something under the water he can help you find it Let's try that again. There we go. And Sky, she can fly high in the air. Cowgirl Sky. They can do a cowgirl team up. We're the rootinest, tootinest cowgirls in the town. Yeehaw! And last but not least, we have Rocky. And he can help you fix just about anything. Look what we have today. It is the Bubble Guppies Clambulance. And it is an ambulance. There is Dr. Molly, the little crab driver, and their patient. And we've got so many Bubble Guppy toys, it is going to be so much fun. We're going to take the ambulance, I mean Clambulance, <laughs> And we've got the hospital here. And we're going to check that out. We've got Rescue Gil. Look at that. And you're not going to believe it. But we also have the Get Well Wishes with Una, who's got a little injured arm. Nurse Dima. And wait for it. Dr. Gobi. And patient Nani. See, he's got a little band-aid on his arm. And it says it works with the checkup center. Works with the checkup center. Ah, it's so exciting. These pieces are really hard to find and are super rare, especially brand new in the box. This is the entire set here. You can see the hospital, the helicopter, the clambulance, and the doctors, Dr. Molly, and there's Dr. Gobi somewhere. I think he's in bed. <laughs> the doctor's not supposed to be in the bed. <laughs> and then we have Nurse Dima and Bubble Puppy. We've got Bubble Puppy too. So we have all of these pieces. It's gonna be so much fun. 
And at the very end of the video, we'll take the clambulance and the school bus and compare them and see how they're different. Look at that! It's the bus! So, are you ready to get this clambulance out of the box? Uh-huh. Let's do it! Let's see, what's the best way to get this out of the box? The bottom. Ah, the bottom. It says open here. Let's try that. Here we go. Some ties. Let's untie them. Oh, that was easy. Sometimes these ties are really hard to open. But these ones are really easy. And let's pull this off. And we've got a piece of tape here. So let's get this tape off. Ah, there we go. I wonder if our clambulance will come loose now. Let's see. Here it comes. Oh. Let's pull the strings off the wheels. There we go. Look at that clambulance. It is really neat looking. It's got a light here on the top. And... It's got wheels that look like bubbles. They're round and blue. Mm -hmm. And the back hatch opens up. You can see inside. So let's get our driver, our doctor, and our patient out. Here we go. Dr. Molly, we're coming to get you out. We need you at the hospital to help with all the patients. Here is Dr. Molly. She's got a purple stethoscope and a little purple notebook. She is ready to take care of her patients. This is so neat. I'm so excited. Let's get the crab out. Oh, here is our little crab driver. Look at that. He has a little hexagon, same as Mr. Grouper. So technically the crab could drive the bus and Mr. Grouper could drive the clambulance. They should be able to trade out. We'll check that out at the end of the video. But right now, let's get our patient out of this container. And our patient is on a little hospital bed. And the blanket folds out so that he can come out of the hospital bed. And he looks like a little dolphin with a helmet on. And now he needs to go and get a Band-Aid at the hospital. And there he's in his bed. So let's get him in the clambulance. Here is the clambulance. And let's put our driver in, just like that. And we need to roll our patient up. Here we go. Now he's in the clambulance. And the doctor is going to join him, make sure everything's okay. And they're on their way to the checkup center. Woo, 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 woo. Woo, 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 woo. Here is the clambulance. Driver Crab made it to the hospital. So let's open up the back door. And here is Dr. Molly and the patient rolling down the back of the slide. Woo. Now it's time to take him in and get him checked in. Thank you, Clambulance. Woo -woo, you're welcome. Now we need our check-in center that says get well wishes. We need to open up this one so that Nurse Dima can check in our new patient. So here we go. Let's open it up. What have we got in here? We've got Nurse Dima, ready to check in the new patient. We've got another patient. Here is Una with her injured arm. So she's going to get checked in too. And our check-in desk. And it's pink. It has a little teddy bear and a stuffed dinosaur. A box of crayons. It looks like a book so the kids can play and read while they wait to go in to see the doctor. So let's get everybody checked in. Here is our check-in desk at the checkup center. Nurse Dima is behind the desk. 
Ready to check in the first patient. Check up time. Next guppy patient, step right up. Next guppy patient, step right up. So here is our first patient. The one that came in on the clambulance. Here he is. Ready for your checkup? Come on. Ready for your checkup? Come on. So we're going to take him and he is going to go in the hospital bed. There we go. And we're going to send him up to his own room up here. Now let's take the next patient. Here is patient Una. She has a bandage on her arm. I'm ready to get checked in. Check up time. Next guppy patient, step right up. Ready for your checkup? Come on. So let's get Una's weight. Here we go. Ah, oh, your weight looks good. Now it's time to go see the doctor. Dr. Molly is busy helping over here, so we need to unbox Dr. Gobi and patient Nani. So let's get them open so that patient Una has a doctor to see. Here we go. Oh, we're almost there. Here is Dr. Gobi, and he has a silver stethoscope and a blue notebook. Very, very neat. And patient Nani. Look at the little band-aid on his arm. Poor Nani. Let's sit him over here. And we have another check-in desk. This one's really cool. It has a computer and some medicines and a little medical bag right here. But right now it's time for Una to see the doctor. All right, Una, it's time to get an x-ray of your arm. So turn this way. Welcome to the x-ray room. And then turn this way. And one more the other way. Skeletons aren't just for Halloween. They're in our bodies every day. All right. I think we're all done with the x-rays, Una. Now the doctor's just going to bandage up your arm, and you'll be good to go. You're ready to go, Una. Time to go down the slide and go home. Your turn, Dr. Gobi. Whee! What about our friend from the clambulance? Do you think he wants to go down? He's going down in his bed! <laughs> As we said before, it's a bed, not a sled. <laughs> he likes to use it as a sled. Let's try that again. Whee! All right, now, who's next? Next guppy patient, step right up. It's helicopter pilot Gil. He landed on top of the hospital. He has a new patient for us. Who do you have, helicopter pilot Gil? I've got a patient named Nani. He's got a boo-boo on his arm. All right, let's take care of patient Nani now. Checkup time. Next guppy patient, step right up. Next guppy patient, step right up. Alright, we're going to take Nani on the elevator. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Time for you to come down and get an x-ray. Today, Dr. Molly is going to take care of you, Nani. Everything looks good in there. So, he's going to go back down the elevator. Here we go. Whee! 
and the clambulance is going to take all of our patients back home. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Everybody load up. Patient Nani, he's got a band-aid on his arm. And patient Una with her cast on her arm. And then we have our patient who is in the clambulance bed, our little dolphin. And he's going to spend the night in the hospital, so he's going to come back up here. He's not ready to go home yet. All right, everybody's loaded up. Time to go. Woo Let's look at some of the other characters we have. Here is patient Bubble Puppy. And we've got Nurse Dima, Dr. Molly, Dr. Gobi. We have another Nurse Dima. And patient Nani, patient Una, there we go, we've got Mr. Grouper, we've got Happy Bubble Puppy, and Rescue Pilot Gill. So we've got a lot of different characters and this isn't even all of them. But let's take a look at the Bubble Guppy bus and Clambulance together. Now it's time to compare the Clambulance with the Bubble Guppies bus. So let's check out the drivers first. Here is our little crab driver. And the bus has Mr. Grouper. And let's see if Mr. Grouper can drive the Clambulance. Well, he doesn't fit through there. Let's see. Oh, it doesn't look like Mr. Grouper can drive the clambulance because he's too big. That's kind of sad. Let's see if the little crab can drive the bus. He can! He fits on there just fine. He can drive the school bus. Driving the school bus. Can you say the wheels on the bus go round and round? Round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round all through the town. Yay! Okay, little crab, back to your clambulance. Put Mr. Grouper back here. Now, let's look at doors. This side on both of them does not have doors. The bus has a stop sign. Okay. And this has a nice symbol here. Let's turn it to the back. In the back. And on the back here, you can see it looks like a window. And there is Molly. And here is her patient right there. And here's the bus. And it has a door. Ooh, and some of our passengers came out. And the clambulance has a door on the back. And there we go. They can roll out. Let's check out the slides. Molly goes down. And Molly goes down. Close them back up. We have a door on the school bus. Like this. And they can come out this door. So the school bus has two doors. And the clambulance only has one door. So let's close that back up. Now the other cool thing about the clambulance is the other pieces that come with it, like helicopter gill. And they go together because they're both part of the rescue. And they go with the checkup center. And you can get, you know, Gobi and all the other characters. Now what you can get with the school bus is pretty neat. Let me show you. This is the school play set. And you can take Gil with his backpack. And we're going to get the bus already over here and sit him up here. And he can go in the school bus from the school playset. You can do it like this. And in he goes. So this is really cool. And the playset is so much fun. We've already done a video of it. Let me show you one other thing it does. And it has a little elevator over there. And you can get some of your characters to dance. So, what kind of music do farm animals use to 
girls like to dance to? I don't know, Gilly. Moo-sick. And they're dancing. And you can also take Mr. Grouper. And he can come over here and go like this. Excuse me, what time is it? It's time for lunch. Excuse me, what time is it? It's time for lunch. And when you open up the lunch boxes. Una got chicken fingers. I got macaroni and cheese. I got macaroni and cheese. That's silly. And they have all the funny lunches that Nani gets. And they have macaroni and cheese. But the cool thing is when you close it and open it back oh, up, Nani got a cheese it changes. Apple juice. I got a quesadilla and grape juice. I got a Peter app and crayon berry juice. That's silly. <laughs> cranberry juice you can see the crayons there and i think there's one more so let's look at that bobby got a turkey sandwich i got a cheese sandwich i got a tube of fish sandwich that's crazy business <laughs> <laughs> so it's a lot of fun and let's do one other thing you can push this button Line up, everybody. and she lines up to go outside Hey everybody, we have the Bubble Guppies Snap and Dress Hair Salon. And this is one of the bigger Snap and Dress sets. And it has 12 playing pieces. And here's the back. You can see how you can put Molly and get her hair done. And this looks like she has bubbles because it's getting washed. And all the different hairdos. Hey, she looks like Dima there. She's got a Dima hairdo. That's funny. Yeah. <laughs> but when we get her all out of the box, we also have in this basket the Snap and Dress Princess, the Snap and Dress Cowgirl, and let's see, we also, ah, here she is, Snap and Dress Ballerina Molly. So we have all four Snap and Dress sets and we are going to play with all of them. But let's start by getting the salon set out of the box. Some more tape to undo up here. And one more piece down here. We got it taped up good. Oh, there's another piece. There's four pieces of tape holding this thing closed. <laughs> now we're in there. And pulling it out. And this was supposed to look like heads up here. My son asked me why there were spoons in there. They kind of look like spoons too. But they're actually supposed to be heads. <laughs> and let's look at all of our pieces. Here is the first hairdo. And that is supposed to make it look like she's got bubbles on her hair. So she's getting her hair washed. And here is pink hair with a yellow crown. Very, very neat. Here is, oh, that looks like Una's hair. It's got little pigtails and it's purple with a star in it. So she can get a Una hairdo. Here is a Molly hairdo. So she can get her hair done just the way she likes it in the show. There is Dima's hair. <laughs> That's cool. So she can look like Dima or Una. And we've got some pretty dresses here too. Look at that beautiful dress. It's got pink and white polka dots with a beautiful necklace and a green top. That is just beautiful. And what do we got over here? This is what she wears in the salon. It's a little bathrobe so that she doesn't get her own clothes wet. So it's a little salon bathrobe. We've got a mirror here that actually shows a reflection. So that's cool. And some more pieces to the salon.
here is Molly. And the last piece. So let's put it all together. Let's put her robe on so she can get her hair all soaked up. And we need somebody to get our hair all soapy and wet. Who will do that for us? It's cowgirl Molly. She's going to come over and do her hair. So get it all soapy. Washing it up. Sud, 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 sud. She's got her little bathrobe on to keep her clothes dry. Now it's time to go get your hair dried out. So she's going to come over here and she can sit right in there and this comes over to dry her hair off. She's getting her hair dried. Once it's all dried, the stylist will come over and style her hair. How would you like your hair today, Miss Molly? I think I would like just like Una's. It's so pretty. All right. She's going to style her hair. Look at that. Her hair is just like Una's. Let's look at the back. <laughs> very, very cute. Little pink star. You know what, Miss Cowgirl Molly? I think I'm going to trade it out. I want to look like Dima. All right, I will style your hair to look like Dima. Look at this! I look just like Dima. This is so cool. I love being able to change my hair, but what about my outfit? I think I need a fancy new dress. Ooh, this is gorgeous. I'm ready to go to the beach ball. Do -do -do. Drink me some coconut water. But I think I want a different hairstyle. Cowgirl Molly, I want a princess hairdo. There is the princess hairdo, but I need a princess dress. So can I borrow a princess dress? from Princess Molly. Here's a princess dress. Oh, now I'm ready to dance. Look at me. What about a different princess hairdo? Let's see what other princess hairdos we have. Ooh, ooh, that one is nice. It's purple with a yellow crown. And we've got a ponytail look. Look at that. Do a ponytail. Let's see if we have a different dress to put on her. Here is a ballerina dress. Aww, I love the ponytail look. You know what, Cowgirl Molly? I think I'm ready to have my own hairstyle back. I'm ready to just be me. Alright, here we go. Ah, that feels much better. I'm back to being Molly. Now I need a good Molly dress. Ugh, that is super fancy, but I'm loving it. You know what? I'd like to see your lasso, cowgirl Molly. I can play you a guitar song if you want. Okay. All right. Now I can play the guitar for you, and you can dance. That sounds like so much fun. Here is Ballerina Molly, Princess Molly, Cowgirl Molly, and Salon Hairstyle Molly. This is really, really neat. Here is her balancing bar and her boom box. And the princess needs her purse. And then Cowgirl Molly has a guitar and a lasso and Salon Molly. You know what? Cowgirl Molly wants to go to the salon and get her hair done. So let's set back up our salon and we'll take the guitar off. 
What kind of hairdo would you like today, cowgirl Molly? I want to look like a princess with lots of curls. All right, here we go. This is our favorite hairdo for lots of beautiful curls. And we need to get you a princess dress. Here is a princess dress. There you go. All you need is a purse. And you are ready to go shopping. A little fish purse. Now Princess Molly, she wants to dress up as a cowgirl and lasso up her some critters. So let's get her with the cowgirl hairdo. Here we go. And she needs a cowgirl dress. There's her cowgirl dress. Here's her lasso. All right, she's gonna try and lasso something. Ah, oh, it's Bubble Puppy! Can she get him? She got her a Bubble Puppy. <laughs> he looks pretty happy about it. Woof, woof. Ah, he took the lasso and he's gone. <laughs> he ran away. <laughs> Look at all of our Mollies. A Molly dressed up as Dima, a Molly just as Molly, Cowgirl Molly, and a Molly dressed up as Una. But if you have any questions, place them in the comments and subscribe to my channel for lots more toys. Thanks guys. Hey everybody, we've got nesting dolls. We've got the Sesame Street Elmo Surprise nesting dolls. And we've got the Bubble Guppies nesting dolls. Look how cool. I wonder who's inside each of these. Let's start with Elmo. Look how cool he is. Let's see who's inside. Da -da -da -da. It's Cookie Monster! Oh wow! Uh-oh, Cookie Monster's already falling apart. Can we get him out? He wants cookies! Mwah, 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 mwah. Give me cookies! We'll give you cookies here in a minute, Cookie Monster. First, we need to see who's inside. I see orange. It is Ernie! Look at that! So we have Elmo, Cookie Monster, and Ernie. Let's open up Ernie. Da 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 da! It's Abby Cadabby! Aww, she's squishy! A little squishy ball. We love Abby Cadabby! And let's put it all back together. There we go. Now let's do the bubble guppies. This is Mr. Grouper, and he's the Bubble Guppies teacher. So let's see who's inside. Da -da -da -da. I see blue. It's Gil. Gil was inside Mr. Grouper. Now let's see who's inside Gil. Da -da -da -da. It's pink. It's Molly. Very, very neat. Now, who's inside Molly? Da -da -da -da. <gasps> Bubble Puppy! And inside Bubble Puppy is empty. Let's see if we can stack these now. Did you know that they stack? Let me show you. On top of Mr. Grouper, we're gonna put Gil. And then on top of Gil, we put Molly. On top of Molly, we put Bubble Puppy. See how well they stack? And then there is Elmo. Can we knock them all over? Whee! Oh, they crashed. All right, let's put them back together. First, we have Mr. Grouper and Gil's bottom, Molly's. 
here is Bubble Puppy. Woof, woof. Let's put Molly in. Then Gil. And then Mr. Grouper. But this was just a fun video of showing you some of my nesting dolls. If you have any questions, place them in the comments. And subscribe to my channel for lots more toys. Thanks, guys. All have sinned, yes, all have sinned, and all fall short of the glory of God. And there is none, not even one, none righteous, no. not even one. For the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life. If you declare, if you declare, that Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him up from the grave you will be saved yes you will be saved